Over 1,000 delegates from across the world have gathered in Accra for the first Africa Data Protection and Privacy Conference. A two-day event will discuss data protection and privacy challenges, solutions, and the enactment of laws to enhance data protection on the continent. Africa loses an estimated $3.5 trillion to cyber attacks annually, two times larger the size of her economy. The massive loss has not triggered significant efforts from the continent to enact data protection and privacy laws, despite increasing use of technology and digitization. Of the 54 countries on the continent, less than 50 nations have passed data protection and privacy laws. Africa is presented with challenges such as transborder data processing, transparency and autonomy of data supervisory institutions. With the increased activity of cyber thefts, it has become imperative for Africa to align her systems to international standards of data protection and privacy. We should identify creative, innovative and privacy enhancing technologies that will support our efforts towards being more accountable in this region. A Deputy Minister for Communications, Mr. Vincent Soa, said the government to provide the needed financial and regulatory support to the Data Protection Commission to enhance their efficiency. The Commission is also taking steps to build the relevant technical capacity in order to upscale its staff while collaborating with peer regulators to incorporate data protection minimum compliance requirements in their eligibility criteria. The United Nations said the outcome of the conference opens the new chapter of improved data protection and privacy in Africa. Um, keep up the efforts because you need the effort in order to be able to comply. But doing so will take time and especially don't underestimate the investment that is required in terms of money, human resources and training. The maiden regional gathering of global experts, policy makers and private sector seeks to share expertise and convince governments to pass data protection laws and increase investment in data protection.